What's up guys, welcome to another video of uh, GTA 5. Got Franklin looking like a gangster. Um, we're going to do a quick run of the Pagani Waira. This is the latest model, it's like done really well. Uh, got a few updates for the car as well, so uh, it just looks gorgeous you know, from the outside. And if we can do first person, you can even see a better um detail like look at the carbon fiber on the tail lights the rear diffuser and essentially though the whole car i mean just looks sick you know the mirrors are carbon fiber the headlight housings are carbon fiber and of course the interior is just absolutely gorgeous they did a really good job uh so let's get right in and the first thing you'll notice is uh the name of the car on the bottom right it actually is the correct name just bagani waira which is uh you know part of the mod uh i think a lot of guys didn't know how to do it at first but now they figured it out and it just you know um it's just way better it's just more realistic um as you can see the interior the hud everything you know the gauges work look at the rpm gauge um and the carbon fiber is really detailed like you can even see the leather stitching and everything looks it looks really good i think it's one of the best interiors of any of the car mods in the game um yeah it's legit for sure it's one of the top car mods in my opinion um i'll post a link to the just uh to the mod in the description below so if you guys want to check it out you know feel free to do that but let's take a quick uh drive in the oh shit uh, oh my god in the wire and you can see the gauge uh, it looks pretty cool, like the, the speedometer actually comes from the right to left. What the fuck, it kind of um, stuttered there, I don't know what was going on. But, you know, visibility is superb. Uh, this car is pretty dope. I feel like um, a younger version of Jeremy Clarkson, you're driving this. Ooh, too close. Too close. You just wrecked a, you know, $1.5 million car. Actually, I think this car might be actually two million if you were to special order it. Uh, I'm not sure, but oh, you fuck! Well, you motherfucker. See what I mean, guys? I hate the traffic in Los Santos. It's just a bunch of idiots. But anyway, let's get to the third-person view, which is my favorite. You can actually see the car in motion. You know, um, the tail light Coronas are done really well. Like when you turn on the headlights. You know, and then, like, look at the reverse lights. Whoa, 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 whoa. Reverse lights are on. Um, and the uh, yeah, headlights are pretty cool. Like, the lights are in the correct positions. It's just an overall really detailed and well-done car mod. This is what uh, they should use in as an example when doing other car mods. Because a lot of guys, what they'll do is they'll, they'll do a mod and it's, like, 90% done. And I hate that because... If you put in a ton of effort into modeling a, a car and then, you know, importing it into the game, you know, you got to go the whole way. Like, why go 90% of the way and then give up? Uh, one of the other mods that pisses me off is the Bugatti Vitesse. What'd you say? Motherfucker. Hey, where you from, homie? Yeah. <laughs> Want me to blast them? Make a getaway in the uh, in the wire? Why not? Bitch ass bullshit. Yeah. Eat shit. God, doing this in first person is legit. Look at this guy just sitting there. Hey, you need some help? Oh, you mother. Uh. Yeah, bitch. Shit. Stupid mutt. Oh, you. you. Damn. Uh, like huge dogs. What the fuck? Alright, time to go. Time to go. Oh my god. Shit, now the police. 
great. Come right in front of me, you piece of garbage. But anyway, the car is not too fast. I, you know, I think the handling needs to be updated. I'm probably going to make it a bit faster. Because um, this is a supercar. It should, you know, get to 100 really quickly. Um, but it's about 120. It's not, not bad at all. But, um, yeah, they need to model other cars after this is how detailed it is. And, and the guy who modded it also included, like, more than 15 liveries for the car. That's the thing. I'm not really sure how to install those. So if you can install the liveries, then, you know, you can change up the, the look of the wire and make it look like a track car. Um, and then there are, like, four wheel textures, too. And I'm not sure how to import those either. So um, you can really, like, change it up and... Which is an overall like you know five out of five for the effort and uh, result for this mod. Um, you know it's just really well done. I, I like it. Um, I'm surprised they haven't imported the uh, Zonda R yet. The Pagani Zonda R. That's one of the the uh, most incredible you know track cars in the world. Um, and of course, as I said in another video, they need to update the sounds. Jeez, what the fuck, man? Getting rid of the goddamn cops is a nightmare in this. Oh my goodness. How do they still see me? What the hell? But yeah, you probably want a faster car to get away from the police. Let's see if we can hide up in the hills here. Just stupid helicopter. Okay, there we go. Let's go up into the hills up there. Yeah, let's cut right through. Shit! Oh my goodness. Yeah, but it just. Oh my god. Oh, you fuck. Shit. Okay, I don't know how I survived that, but anyway, that is the Pagani Waira in Grand Theft Auto, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Hit the like, subscribe, and uh, stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching.